The HTML completion attribute default value setting lets you control if VS Code uses single or double quotes when completing HTML attributes. Now by default, VS Code will use double quotes. So in this image tag, for example, if I was going and completing the source attribute, so I'll say SRC, hit enter, you can see it's automatically added the double quotes here and placed my cursor inside of those. Now you might have a linter rule or a style preference that prefers using single quotes instead, and that's where this setting can come in handy. So I'm gonna go delete this setting, and then I'm gonna open up my user settings with control comma or command comma on Mac, and I'll search for HTML attribute. I want the HTML completion attribute default value setting again. You can see that the default value for this is double quote, but I can go and I can click on this to change it to single quote instead. And when I do this and go back to the file here, and I'll go and again type the source attribute. So I'll say SRC, hit enter. You can see that it's gone and used single quotes instead, and again, place my cursor inside of there. So for any attribute that I type in here, so I'll say alt, for example, it is now going to use single quotes. Now, I, there's actually another value for this setting as well, and that is the empty setting. So if I go back to my settings here and change this to empty instead, now, instead of filling in, in quotes, VS Code is just going to leave the attribute bare and I'd be free to type my own quotes. So here with the empty setting, if I say SRC, you can see it's inserted the equal sign here, but it's not automatically inserted in any quotes. I could just go and type those to actually add the attribute value. So that's the HTML completion attribute default value setting for VS Code.